Welcome to sketch spray painting, crafting and do it yourself art. What's up my great and awesome YouTubers, welcome to Sketch Art. To all of you who are first time here on this channel, I'm Sketch and I'm a spray paint artist. Before I go further, I just want to thank to all of you who support my channel on each way or another. Especially great thanks to all of you who are supporting my channel by purchasing some of my art through my web store. To all of you who are interested in some of my art, check down below in the description box, I'll put the link where you can find it. Also great, great, great thanks to all of you who are liking and sharing my videos and leaving awesome and supportive comments on my previous videos. Videos. It really means a lot for growing this channel and to those of you who didn't watch them before You can check some of them here. I'll put them in the cards. Okay, I'll share the story today's video It won't be me making some painting and this is not kind of videos that I love to make just because English is my second language And during recording I make some of mistakes that I noticed during editing video and then it's too late Anyway guys, you're awesome and I never heard actually complaining on my English. So I decided that in today's video I will make tutorial video how to make Valentine's heart because in a few days it will be Valentine's Day and I thought this could be really good and unique and original way to surprise your Valentine. So this tutorial video will be from very beginning. I'll start with the stencil and then we're gonna spray paint heart. And when I finish with spray painting, when painting is dry, I use security UV marker, something like this. I'll put it in link in description so you can check it on Amazon. So in the end, I'm gonna use this marker to apply secret message that could be seen just under UV light. And I think this is really original, cool and unique gift for Valentine. Anyway, I hope you will like it. I hope you will enjoy it. I hope you will find it useful. And I really hope that some of you will even surprise their Valentine with this kind of gift. Anyway, give it a thumbs up and share it with your Valentine. And if you're first time here on this channel, if you like this kind of content, smash that subscribe button for more future videos like this and hit that ring bell notification so you can get notification every time when I post new video. Stay awesome, I love you all and let's go to make some art. Okay guys, let's get started. First thing we need to do, we need to make stencil. This is the same paper that I'm using for spray painting and I'm gonna use this paper for making stencil. So I'm gonna fold it in a half like this. It don't need to be perfect. Just fold it in a half. Now we have something like this, right? You don't need to be perfect, you can rework it if you don't like how it turned out. But it's something like this. I'll use this. And we have something like this. I'm using most of time this one, but this one will work just fine. You just need to do this. And that's all. It's like new now. We remove this one, unfold the heart, and this is how our heart will look. This actually stands up. One more thing what I do when I finish with my stencil, I use a piece of tape and just do something like this and put it like this so you can remove it later from painting pretty easy. You can add one more just in case. So yeah. 
Okay, let's go. So we have stencil here and we're gonna place it on a painting where we desire to be our heart. I'll put some weight on it and then with any of color we're just gonna mark it where our heart will be. Remove stencil and as you can see we have shape of heart here. Now I'm gonna use different shades of red, pink and purple colors. It really doesn't matter much uh, which color you'll put where you just need to be creative you just need to put any color anywhere let's say we'll put red like this Now I'm gonna use black, white and turquoise color for shading. First of all, I'm gonna, I'm gonna prepare my magazine papers for making texture. You're just gonna fold it like this. Ah, that will be enough. And I'm gonna cover all of this with white color first and then I'll add shades on this part like this with black and turquoise so it can a little bit pop out. And we'll just use newspaper to make some awesome texture. Check this out. If you don't like how your texture turned out, just redo it. And now I'll just add a little bit of on this side. Now you need to let it dry for a few minutes or second option is to dry it with flame. You don't need to put flame on the picture, you just need to go over it. You don't need to do that either. <laughs> now, there's a one thing that I like to do. I'm gonna put my stencil here. So I can mark where my, actually where this heart will be. Just remove the stencil. Okay, it's not clear. And I'm gonna use a piece of paper like this so I can make line. So you want to follow this line actually to put it a little bit like this. So actually you need to follow this line and to put it like this. You don't need to do exactly like this. I like to add, add this detail because it will make it to pop out a little bit. 
and you can do the same thing on the other side as a reflection with white color. And we're gonna dry it a little bit. Now we're gonna take stencil that we made and we're gonna try to put it on the same line where we mark it. Something like this. And I'm gonna use weight, some, some kind of weight, any kind. I saw a lot of people use metal notches but I use just rocks or some heavy things. You just want to your edges sit on the paper. And now this is really up to you which color you will use. I'll use dark colors on the top and go lighter down. your caps are dirty like this one you just need to remove color from caps Now we're gonna apply stars, just spray paint a little bit on your finger. And make stars like this. Now we are ready to remove our stencil. Now you can play with it, you can add some shadows. I like to use I like to use three dots here to make just like I am gonna use transparent this is transparent pink color you don't need to use it it's really rare to find it and as I said you can play with shadows you can do whatever you want now I'm just gonna add a little bit shadow here
our painting is finished. Check this out. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. I hope you like it. I hope you enjoy it. If you like it, give the thumbs up and share it with your friends and family. And to all of you who are interested in some of my art, check down below in the description box. I'll put the link where you can find it. And to all of you who are not subscribed yet on this channel, if you like this kind of content, smash that subscribe button for more future videos like this. Stay awesome. I love you all and see you next spray paint video.